thanks to this uh, imaging advancements, we can now take more than one image to always make sure that the patient positioned correctly, or maybe take images during treatment and predict if the patient will move uh, based on like the history of the movement, let's say. So right now we're treating a, a prostate cancer using uh, uh, like a, a machine that kind of act like the cy cyber knife, right? It's because it has a very focused laser. Uh, I, I call it laser, but it's, you can think about it as a laser, but it's like a, a focused beam of, radio, of radiation. And then it's tracking the movement of the prostate because inside the prostate, it's very uh, common for us that we use golden fiducials to always be sure that the prostate is there when we take x-ray images. So now this machine can track the movement of the prostate and it can also compare this movement with the history of, of the movements before to always predict how the future movement will be. That No human can do that. All the machines can do that, right? Because humans can uh, save all this data in their head and then maybe predict. And then they can't analyze, let's say, hundreds of patients and know that this trajectory is looking kind of identical to another patient a year ago. And then it probably will be like this today because that patient did this movement today too. And, you know, it's all these cool things that we have today that will facilitate treating patients that we considered maybe either too hard to treat before, or we couldn't treat them because of the side effects that they had before, especially, let's say, for rectal cancer patients and so on. Now we have online adaptive treatments, and hopefully that will help us minimize the margins, the radiation, based on how the patient looks today and not a week ago, because that's what most centers do, right? It's, it's too hard to always replan the treatment dose every day. But now with AI and all these tools we have and the image quality, you can do it on the couch while the patient is there. And the treatment could take up to one hour, but that's fine. If, if your goal and intention is to offer the best treatment possible for that patient, then you succeed it, at least. In most cases, this is like the common sense. You have to adapt your margins based on today and not a week ago.